It might be too late for the summer session, and I don't even know if this will reach any high school students, but I wanted to say that a really great option for high school students wanting to get more hands-on time in the lab is to take classes at a community college, especially over the summer when you have some more free time. This is commonly referred to as dual enrollment, and at least in the U.S., you can often do this for free when you're in high school. Um, you just have to pay for textbook and lab costs and things like this. I took chemistry and I took biology and I took an anatomy course, which was really, really fun um, when I was still in high school. So I took an anatomy course one summer and that was a really great way to spend my summer. Um, and basically you also get college credit or high school credit. Um, it depends on your district and things like this, how exactly all that grading and credits and all that works out. But you might even be able to get some of your like prereqs and things like that taken care of so you can save money when you actually get to the college stage. So when you're doing this sort of dual enrollment, it gives you access to a variety of classes that you wouldn't have at your school. So I wouldn't have anatomy at my high school, but I could go and I could take anatomy and I can actually do dissections and things like this. So that was a really great opportunity. And it also gave me more experience working in a lab and access to more advanced topics than I could get in high school. And so various school districts have different sort of like official programs with different community colleges, but typically also you can just enroll as a high school student in whatever community college is near you, even if your school doesn't have a specific affiliation with them. So you're going to have to go and look into the details about the, the different options for for your school and how they're going to interpret the grades and send the credits and all this sort of thing. So that's all going to depend on where you live, what school you're in, things like this. But typically, as long as you have like the permission of your school, the permission of your parents, that sort of thing, you're able to, if you're like at least 16 usually, then enroll in community college classes. And this can be a really, really great opportunity, especially if you don't have access to higher end like resources and labs and that sort of thing in whatever school you're in. And so I found it a really great option and a lot of people probably don't even know that it is an option. So I just wanted to say it's out there. It's a great option. Um, so go ahead, look into those community college classes. Just know that like during the school year, you don't want to overload yourself. So that's why I recommend like during the summer se semester is really great. During the summer semester, they typically have shorter a shorter term with a more intensive class. So yeah, summer anatomy was like super duper intense, but it was also a really, really fun opportunity, really fun experience. Um, and so yeah, it's just a nerdy way to have fun and also get some credit and that sort of thing. And so hope you find it helpful and pass this advice along to high school students you know if you're not a high school student and you're still listening um, and you think this could help someone. So happy learning.